Today's game discusses themes of death, specifically suicide and that from a deadly widespread disease. On top of that, the game's creator, Robert Brock, aka Wardpole, tragically took his own life in June of 2018. Presentable Liberty clearly represents his depression and the loneliness he felt during his final years, and we hope that it will live on to remind others who may be experiencing depression or something adjacent that they aren't alone and that there are people who care about you. I know it can be really hard to internalize that, I've been there. The message of the game is to never give up, even in the most hopeless and lonely situations, and its execution is one that really sticks with you. As a disclaimer, we didn't know about the tragic loss of the game's creator until most of the way through the video. With that being said, we sincerely hope you enjoy, and reiterate that viewer discretion is advised. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, all you beautiful, loud people out there, it's your boy, the most important person on this YouTube channel, and I'm here with my friend and co-host. The second most important person on this YouTube channel, it is Ian. No, you're third, Mary Jane's second. But you know what they say, though. What? First is the worst, and second is the best. Well, Mary Jane's second. No, Mary Jane's an unpaid intern, she doesn't count. I think she counts. Nah. Yeah, Unless, I... Well, she only counts if you start paying her, Jay. That's my deal. I don't want to pay Mary Jane. <laughs> okay, then she doesn't count. <laughs> God damn it. She's been staring at me like, please. please like, I just want money for treats, man. <laughs> Somehow she got addicted to catnip because that's totally how that works. Of course. I'm addicted Anyways, to catnip. Um, this game came out like six years ago. Yeah, apparently six years ago, the, the Jacksepticeye and Markiplier played it. Yeah. And I watched those videos. Back I did. It came out. And uh, haven't since. I am like. I remember I, liking this game. As usual, I'm uncultured as fuck. I, I remember that I said he liked this game. <laughs> that being said, I remember next to nothing about it. I just remember the basic gameplay and like kind of how the ending worked. So it's going to be fun. Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, so this is technically. Um, this is technically the second game in the series, uh, but the first one is Exopto Money, which Mark didn't play until after the first game, any or this game anyways. And it's kind of a cookie cl clicker analog that has a little bit of backstory, but it's kind of not important for this game. And I don't really want to play that game right now. So we're going to play Present of Liberty. This is true. And, and we're, we're going to start from the beginning. Day one. Day one. How ominous. Fucking five days a stranger up in here. Where the fuck am I? In prison. That's a clock. Mm-hmm. Very comfortable bed, of course. Uh, dude, this this literally looks like <laughs> the worst thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Why are there wires, wires there? wires there. Okay, so I can move with that, interact with with click, and, and uh, this one, two, and three sl the item, slide the item, F item. for toggle, spill, screen, which I'm totally going to use. Um, let's mm -hmm. interact with everything. Can we leave? We cannot. Nope. Not, not seemingly no. Press the left mouse button and open the letter under the door. What the fuck? My dear friend, I hope this letter finds you so, well. This is the travel traveler. Give the traveler a good voice. Maybe a strong. My voice. dear friend, I hope this letter finds you well. How is prison life going for you? I, I'm, I know it must be hard. I thought that was a jail. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Especially in times like these. As for me, I will soon start another of my journeys into the unknown. Known. Wish me luck. Salvador, the traveler. <laughs> Fucking Salvador. Yep. <laughs> There's Where? another one. Okay. Is it just gonna be? Is this just gonna be me fucking reading notes? I'm so confused. Why? Not entirely. Why am I locked up? You'll see. Friend, I hope you aren't feeling too lonely in that dark cell. Just in case, I put a little bug friend for you in the envelope alongside this letter, Salvador. To be honest, that bug should have died. <laughs> like, think about it. Like, bugs don't survive. Where would he go? Probably under your bed. He'll show up. I'm gonna sit in my corner and wait. All right. Prison life sure is entertaining. Prison life is quite entertaining. You know the mo the the most bizarre part is that how these letters keep coming in within point two seconds of each other. <laughs> like how, how do well, I get this top secret on it? Are you supposed to get? Wait, why is there a, just a normal looking door over there? This is a That's prison a cell, right? The letter says top secret on it. Oh. Good day. We are happy to inform you that you have been selected by me, Dr. Money, to join an exclusive program for inmates all over the country. 
You're confusing me, sir. We have noticed that due to the recent outbreak of a terrible virus- Oh, shit. Oh, God. wait wait a minute. Wait a minute. The population of our beautiful nation has started dwindling. This is unfortunate, but there is still hope for you. Wait a minute. This oh, is sorry, there's still hope. Current events. <laughs> current events. Yeah, you know, this was six years ago, guys. I did not plan this. I didn't Recent either. studies are that 98% of our great nation's population is already infected with the virus, and generally many of the remaining 2% are prison inmates like you. We hope you continue to be vigilant and remain healthy. In order to fight depression and suicidal thoughts in the dire situation you found yourself in, you will be assigned your own personal happy buddy trademark. Enjoy. Oh, I don't want a happy buddy. Nope. <laughs> nope, I have my bug, and I'll sit in my corner. I refuse. <laughs> Oh, you're, you're, you're bug friend. Bug friend! I'm gonna, I'm gonna name you Charles. Okay. All right, Charles. Should we open up this letter from my happy friend? God, I, I really fucking hate that shit. Happy I feel like if I read a letter from my happy friend, I'm gonna want to kill myself more. It's gonna be great. I promise. Hello, hello, hello. I'm your own personal happy buddy trademark. I have a present for you. Five confetti poppers. Have fun. Press the right button to use. Right mouse button to use. You can use them all now or save them, whatever you want. <laughs> it's raining all over, Charles! Alright, you're out of confetti poppers. That's okay. <laughs> Wait, that's... That it's wasn't... In the bed, it's fine. That's not normal. Hello, my buddy friend. Uh, my buddy friend, buddy. Do you enjoy the confetti? If so, I have another present for you. Oh, God. What is he gonna give me now? Charles, did you like the confetti? <laughs> I hope you did. It was all for you. Well, now it's on the floor for the rest of the game. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Dr. Money Portal Entertainment Machine. Game included. Have lots of fun. What's on that? <laughs> Serpent. Oh my <laughs> god, is this... <laughs> Almost. Oh. It's not it's not quite snake, but it's similar. Okay, let's, let's play this for a minute. I'd rather not talk to that fucker. It's snake, but with levels. Snake with levels? This isn't how snake's supposed to work. <laughs> Whack. Perfect. Uh, good job. Is there a way to beat this game, or do you just like, it will it just yeah, go yeah. on forever? Uh, it, uh, it says four of something. Four of 20. Is it two? Okay. I, can't know. I think that says 20. Yeah, that's, tw oh, oh no, 90. Oh, 90? I can't tell if that says 20 or 90. I'll get it to 20, and if it, it might be 50, actually. Who knows? I can't tell. I can't read it very well. You can also, you know, come back and play this game later. It's always on your device. That's a good point. My dear friend, I have started my journey in the Far East with no clear goal in mind. On the road, I met a nice woman who made, gave me directions in the, to the nearest lake. You know how much I like swimming. Friend, this lake is beautiful. It's so peaceful and quiet here. Have you ever been so alone that you cannot convince yourself of the fact that other people exist anymore? Salvador. Well, you're kind of in prison, so that's uh... To be fair, I'm kind of living that. Yeah. <laughs> Friend, I have a present for you. It's a painting that always reminds me of the spirit of travel. I hope it will liven up your cell a little bit, Sal. Well, look around your cell. That's cool. I'm gonna play this game because I don't feel like <laughs> I'm dealing with my happy buddy <laughs> trademark. God, fuck that dickhead. Like, I love the idea of like a game that takes place kind of in one room, but also like the room changes throughout the game. Oh yeah, for sure. It's it's kind of. Cool. How do I get through here? With precision gameplay, which I totally do. Eh. <laughs> I got this. No, I don't. Come on, I gotta make it past this level. Fuck! I almost made it. Yeah, you're very close. Nope, not almost. that time. <laughs> not that time either. Wait, I think I figured out the best way to do this. Okay. Nope, not like that. So you go down and you don't hit a rock, right? Mm-hmm. Just hey. like that. Wait, how is this easier? Is it? It looks easier. It probably isn't, actually. A lot of narrow paths, though. Fuck, I was wrong. <laughs> Give me back the other one. <laughs> Wee. One turn at a time. Fuck. Yeah. We'll we'll go through 
this level if we can make it through and then we'll read the happy buddy letter yeah we're gonna read the happy buddy letter <laughs> oh boy all right come on computer 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 sorry my computer's being weird all right Hey buddy, how are you doing? If you're feeling down, maybe a song will help. La 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 la, happy, la la, glad to la la, be alive, la la. I'm not. Ha 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 ha, that was fun, wasn't it? I hope you keep a song in your heart always. For you, for your smart and kind and important. Damn, they really haven't to dig to the bottom of the barrel to give me compliments, huh? Good day, Mr. Smiley. We have noticed, <laughs> Mr. Smiley. Mr. Smiley, now <laughs> we have noticed that you are not me. Uh, that, that you have not met your happiness quota yet. Remember, you will only get to see your daughters again if you manage to lower the suicide rates in prison. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Dear Blaine, we may have accidentally sent you a letter addressed to a certain Mr. Smiley. We want to know that that, it, that this mistake has been rectified and that your happy buddy really does like you and is your best friend purely because you are so friendly. Holy shit, so they're holding that guy against his will with his daughters? What the fuck? And now it's dark. Oh, yep, time to go to bed. I don't do that dark. <laughs> How are you doing? My feel I'm feeling so great. You are my bestest, friendliest, happy friend in the whole wide world. I'm just gonna keep reading let notes. I don't do sleep. God. Friend, if my calculations are correct, then this letter will arrive to your cell right around bedtime. I hope those prison beds are comfortable. Good night, friend. Salvador. Dolly. And bedtime. Press space to go to bed. Day two. All right, morning time. Good morning, world. We're going to play some more snake. <laughs> some more serpent. S uh, totally not trademark because it says serpent on it. Mm -hmm. Fuck, I hate this. It's brilliant. What do you mean it's brilliant? Yeah. It's a fantastic game. Why do I just disagree on all <laughs> levels? <laughs> like, look at this shit. I, I'd rather play real snake than this. Well, of course. Ah! Well, with this game is it actually has progress, you know? It's like it's like you can get to the end, which is motivation. Does this work with the- nope, it doesn't work with the arrow keys, it's just W-A-S-D. Wee! Nope. <laughs> nope. G chill. Fuck! Okay, fucking happy buddy looking motherfucker. and shine sleepy head i hope you had a good night's sleep i sure did hooray i hope you die i hope this guy kills himself by the end and i have to go meet his daughters and tell them what happened to him to celebrate the occasion <laughs> of you getting up i have sent you a second game for your portable entertainment product thank god i was getting so bored of serpent all right maybe we should check on it and see what it is fear of fire i get to play as charles Yep, and you just stay away from fire. Now this is a game levels. I can get behind. <laughs> and more and more fire exists every time. Is it gonna be eventually to a point where like everything's fire? I do not remember. I just remembered Serpent. I didn't even remember this game existed. I just knew there was more games. That's the thing, thing about games like this. You like you do the what you can to move the least. Yeah. You don't need to move unless you need to move. Yep. Uh, this, see, this game's super easy because the fire doesn't go towards you. It just goes in a random direction. See, to make this harder, then they should do every time it bounces, it goes towards you. Yeah, it should be like a tracer type thing. Y you know, like, this is like... This is just sad. Yeah, kind of easy. There's only 20 levels. Then, well, then let's just beat fucking... <laughs> beat Fear of Fire. Beat Fear of Fire, let's go. Beat it like a red-headed stepchild, you know what I mean? Of course. We Or child, Seven, as I said earlier. Six. Five. five four. Three. Two. two one. one. Happy New Year. What are those blue fires for? 
They leave a trail, so you can't touch the trail. Oh. Marginally more dangerous. How dangerous? <laughs> Alright, it's starting to get a little crowded, though. Oh, yeah, for sure. They Damn, do. this is like my bed. <laughs> you know, with all the women? God. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Eight. Halfway through the game. I have to start kicking people off sometimes whenever it gets like this, you know what I mean? Three, two, one. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. A lot of New Year's going on currently. You've been playing the game a while, just saying. Not really. <laughs> Dude, it's been like two minutes. Am I going to flawless this entire like 20 levels? That'd be great. I'd love to see that. Because the answer is probably yes. Unless the game pulls some bullshit. That's what I'm saying. Unless I get like cheated. <laughs> nope. Not today. Fuck. My <laughs> fucking bracelet killed me. Good job. Fuck bracelets. Not literally though. Because that's kinky as fuck. Don't kink shame, Jay. <laughs> Who's in a fucking bracelet? I'm sure somebody is. I mean, I'm not kink shaming anybody, but foot fetishes are kind of whack. <laughs> Sorry, it's just like I know people who are, and I just don't understand it. That's the thing about all that I mean, stuff. I don't really understand any I of think it. I think, okay, the thing with that, right, is I don't care. People can do what they want. Oh, yeah, I don't um, care that the much. The problem just with that is it's really, really easy to find pictures of feet of anybody. <laughs> so it's like, it's like just that kind of thing of where, you know, it's easier for someone to to fetishize, like to... Fuck, I was like I at the know, one second mark. Get off on the feet of someone who really does not want that, you know? Like, the thing with something like porn, for example, is, you know, at least, you know, the people in porn, like, know what the video is being used for, you know? Exactly. Um, but, you know, when someone just, like, has feet in a photo of theirs, and then someone, like, is creepy about it, then that's kind of, kind of scary, you know? Oh, yeah. For sure. Um, Shit because, you know, an, an easily accessible thing. But, on the other hand, if somebody isn't creepy about it and is actually, like, a good person, then I have no problem with somebody who has a foot fetish. Yeah, but I feel like, I don't know. Just the idea of any of that just doesn't make any sense to me. That's all. No, I have to beat, I have to beat the fire game. I have to beat Shark Boy and Lava Girl. <laughs> you know they made a sequel to that movie? They did? It's yeah, awful. I saw the, I like the original. Well, I mean, to be fair, I haven't seen the original in years. To so be fair, I the original like was like the, like one of the wor worst qual quality things ever. Oh, definitely. I'm sure. Like seriously, I liked the original when I was young, so I, I'm sure if I rewatched it, I'd hate it. Um, you'd love to hate it. Is the thing. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. When I talk about movies like that, then I can never actually say I like it. Cause I'm like, hold on, that was ten years ago. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Oh my god, it's so crowded. Yeah, I mean, 17 out of 20. There are four levels left. Three levels? 70. 60. No. Wait, wait. 50. Two levels would be... 40. 30. 20. 21. Ah, damn it! Oh, damn it. 29, 28, 27, ah! 29, or... 29, 28. 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, oh, uh, 18. I ain't trying 17, to figure it out. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, Damn it. 10, 20, 9, 19, 18, 20, <laughs> 18, 17, 16. You go with the logic that they're gonna be like the D, the, the, the DVD player thing, so they'll never hit the corner. 15. No, they'll hit the corner. 13. 12. Ah! 20. 19. 18. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Jake. Penultimate level, you have to beat it now. Exactly, it's too far. I'm too far gone. We're wasting so much time. I don't care. Someone's gonna find this entertaining. This is gonna be the longest playthrough of this game on the internet. 
Probably. Well, I mean, I think we're the longest playthrough of any game on the internet. You are right. Eight, nine. One more. Eight. Damn it, there's too much stuff nine, on the screen. Eight. Seven. Ten. Nine. Eight. Ah! Eight, nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Ah! Ten. Nine. No, no, eight, no, 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 no. no. Seven, Homies, chill. Ah! Ten. Everybody, nine, chill. Eight. Remember you said you're gonna do a flawless run of this game? Well, to be fair, that was like a level like 15. <laughs> Five. Four. Three, two, one. Damn it! Jesus Christ, ten. Ten. Nine. Dude, it's eight, only ten seconds. Seven, ten, nine, eight, seven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, ten. Hey, Jay, have you played VVVVVVV or seen it? What the fuck is that? It's a game called VVVVVV. I don't want to know. It's my favorite platformer. Like, I, right now, no, that's not true. Celeste is my favorite platformer. But I don't know. I Celeste played it is. long before I played Celeste, so it's my. It was my favorite platformer for a time, but now it's my second favorite platformer. A lot of people played it. Jack played it a long time ago. Game Grumps played it at one point. Well, we are better than Game Grumps. We are. Meaning we have to steal all of their content. True. Why do you think we played Dong and Rampa? We did it better. <laughs> we played Dong and Rampa before they did Jay. No, 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 no. No, we, we we will we add to add to the hilariousness we stole it. Um Wait, did they? Wait, did, did they play I thought they played BBG. They right? played it after us because it was after we started. You were like, oh yeah, Game Grub started. Yeah. Yeah, they did, okay. It just didn't come up in the search results because they're not relevant anymore. Yeah, no one cares yeah, it about was, it. Was, it was Ross and Aaron who played BBV. Ross and Aaron. Seven years ago. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this sucks. <laughs> It's the last level, Jade. I know, so I can't quit, but I want to. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, four, Damn it. Ten, nine, eight, ten, nine, eight, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Hey, year. a valuable badge has been placed in your vicinity. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. It's on the wall. Woo. See, it has, this, it has Charles on it. Of course. Charles, come out and see your pet, your medal, bud. <laughs> Anyhow. Friend, I have decided to head north, which is, as you know, my favorite cardinal direction to head <laughs> On, on the way, I pass by a very interesting river. A sign next to it said the water changes the direction it is flowing in around the time of year. It's, it's worth noting that he spelled favorite the British way. <laughs> so he's British. Well, he's an explorer. He's an adventurer. Of course he's British. Or he's Australian. Fascinating. Wouldn't you say, friend? <laughs> I would stay here and, and witness the change of caring. My curiosity is too tremendous to resist the temptation. As much as I enjoy vast landscapes and new locations to explore, someone in life must appreciate the little things. Sal. This is Jake confirmed. Listen, my all my British voices are the same. <laughs> <laughs> I have another present for you. It's supposed to remind you to always keep a smile on your face. Oh god, did he get <laughs> That freaks me out. This is like the Kool-Aid man but serial killer. Jay, what? Look at like look at the look at the image at, like on the other wall real quick. So I know I'm not supposed to bring him Homestuck too much. Oh, you son of a bitch. Doesn't that kind of look like Jake's planet? <laughs> Ooh. Um, do you want me to be this character too, or do you want to- Yeah, you can take this one. Okay. Good day. I don't think you know me, but from what I've heard, it seems that you and I are the last people in this town who are still not infected with the virus. The virus? It, it isn't real, sweetheart. The, the government made it up. I am the owner of a pastry shop. Oh, world under pastries? <laughs> no, I want you to die. Not far from where your cell is. But as I don't want to get infected, I cannot sell my pastries to anyone anymore. Except you. I would really appreciate it if you, can't, you could come visit me sometime and maybe have a cup of tea. Interesting. By the way, my name is Charlotte. Nice to meet you. 
my dearest companion. The, the river's change in direction was quite interesting to see. It's exactly what I love about my travels. You always get to see new and amazing things, Salvador. I'm very sorry if I came off as too eager in my last letters to you. Fact is, I haven't really had much contact with people anymore lately. Please forgive me if I made you feel uncomfortable. Charlotte. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. I hope you're enjoying your two games. They were expensive, you know. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Is he going to give me another one? <laughs> Please don't be sad. I know it must be hard and all alone in a prison cell, but you must remain happy. This guy's manic. Please. It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has shown signs of behaving in an excited and of not behaving in an excited and happy manner. If you wish to have your happy buddy replaced, please just send us a letter and we will get rid of him. Oh God! Hello, ha ha ha! Hello, I heard that some people are reporting their happy buddies to Doctor Money. Ah. Oh God! You know what happens to them, right? Do you? You wouldn't want to do that to me, right? Would you? <laughs> I'm sorry, I haven't gotten another got you another game yet. I just don't have money for it at the moment. I'm so sorry. So very sorry. Oh god. Yeah. And then the letter stopped. Yeah, for now. Can we play more serpent? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Are you still on this level? Yep. <laughs> what do you think so far while you're playing Serpent? It's 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 very interesting. This it's a game. game. It, it's like now, like there's a virus going around, which would never happen IRL. But well, like it's never, never, it's never happened before. But uh, God, this came out six years ago. <laughs> it was calling it. Yep. Predicting the future. Let's try. It this knew again. that when I and J, the best YouTubers of all time, was gonna play this game, it would be relevant. So. <laughs> Of course we knew. We're just geniuses. Of course. Yeah, I'm, t I'm tired of Serpent. Another letter. Friend, is your bug friend keeping you company? Have you given him a name? Yes, he's yes. Charles. You should. Do you remember how we used to sit by the fireside carving chess pieces out of wood without a cat in the world? That was a long time ago. I don't remember Aww. carving chess pieces. That's kind of cute. Charles! Why Charles do I name likes him Charles? Places. My wood carving skills have gotten significantly worse, but I still tried to make you something to make you feel less lonely. It's a leg of a table I'm making for you. I know that <laughs> not, might not be the most extravagant project, but I hope you like it anyways. Salvador. It's a single table leg. <laughs> Eventually there'll be a full table. <laughs> but you for think? now there's only a single leg. God damn it. You've got to send it to you one piece at a time, just like uh, Homestuck's Boy, the robot thing. Anyway, we're just going to keep playing. Just keep playing, just keep playing. playing Charles playing, just playing. vibing. Yeah. Charles to be vibing though. I'm surprised Charles hasn't ha hasn't left your cell through the door. Can he do that? Probably not, but I mean just like in terms of in game logic or like, you know, out of game logic. Meta gaming shit. <laughs> in a meta sense, how is he is he programmed to not go through there? Hell yeah. I mean almost almost certainly, but you know, still like in in like from a lore standpoint, why the fuck has Charles not left the cell? I would have. It's a nice evening, isn't it? I hope you have a nice sleep, Charlotte. Uh, point your bed. I can't interact. Space bar. It. It's space bar, remember? Yeah, but it won't let me yet. Oh. I have to wait till it actually tells me. Oh, probably until. Until six, it gets apparently. <laughs> Until six. Six is when it clock. gets dark. The clock said six. Whack. Good morning. What does the clock say now, actually? Five. Six p.m. to five p.m. Oh, six six p.m. to five a.m. Jesus Christ, that's a lot of sleep. Oh yeah. Morning, morning, morning. I have some very, very good news for you. Do you have another video game for me, you fucking stingy fuck? I sold my kidney and bought another game. A pog. <laughs> Wait, let's watch this and see if we'll, if we see anyone come up to the window. No. Nope. I got you the, a new game with the last of my money. This one's a real blast. Have fun. No, I didn't mean that. 
hideous moonlight. Oh. <laughs> so it's like Flappy Bird, but not Flappy Bird? Yeah. Now this one might be easier than the other one. And Serpent. Oh yeah, but I'm not sure if it's easier than the Fly one. Yeah. I don't think I'm ever going to beat Serpent, though. Maybe not. You I say am... that, but this is level 3, Jay. <laughs> You're level three, Ian. Sure. Shit. Listen, I haven't played a game like this in a hot minute. All right, I'm done. <laughs> You're good. We'll come back. <laughs> Don't worry about me spending all the money. I'm okay. Okay. As long as he doesn't kill my daughters, I'm fine. Just stay happy for me. For the love of all that is holy, stay happy. They're watching. Jesus Christ. Charles! Can, can I interact with Charles? Nope. I, I don't know who thought that poster would be a good idea. This one? <laughs> yeah. The Kool-Aid Man, but on steroids. And that is and definitely meth. blood splatter. No, this is the one that- this is when the Kool-Aid Man did acid. Of course. Anyway, back to Flappy Bird. You used all your poppers, like, immediately. Your confetti poppers. I did. Could have saved them a little bit, you know? Well, why? So you can, like, confetti pop every time, like, when you beat a game or something. Like, at a cool event. Nah, I mean, like... <laughs> but why wait, you know? You're like, I got five party poppers. I'm gonna pop them all right now in quick, <laughs> quick succession. Exactly. So Damn it. DMPEP. -E DM pep. Just one second, letter man. Fuck it. Uh, I for me that's a woman. <laughs> the world has become such a quiet place. Letter woman. That's true. Anyway, back to back. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking letter making me stop the game for that. At least have something cool to say. God, you know I might we might be taking away from like like I might be taking away from this experience by being here. How this, so? might, th this game might, like, try to make you feel alone, you know what I mean? True. But whatever. We're a co cool commentary channel, so... We're a cool oops. commentary channel. No one gives a fuck. What the fuck do you want, Charlotte? So many people are dying. I watched them choke to death from my pastry shop's window. Dr. Money has started selling some kind of antidote, but I don't trust him. I love death. Death is pog. Death does equals poggers, it's true. That's it. I think I'm going to jail. <laughs> You're already in jail. <laughs> I'm going to double jail. I will not leave my shop. As much as the loneliness pains me, I need to remain here. I might catch COVID and die. Oh no! She's gonna get the China virus! <laughs> God, uh, dear God, that shit's so dumb. Yeah, like calling it the China virus and stuff. Agreed. Hashtag stop Asian hate legitimately. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Because I keep reading story after story about people like actually getting like assaulted because like people are like blaming them, but this has nothing to do with them. Yeah, no, it's absolutely insane. Yeah, no. stop Asian hates one uh, one of those movements that I've not necessarily look too much into because i'm fucking busy as hell um but i know a lot of people who support it and i and i certainly will get on that bandwagon i'll be like hey yeah fuck yeah stop hate and hate yeah i agree i just see it a lot on people's like timelines yeah and, stuff. and there's some people that i know that i support and like a lot that support it so how are you doing i've been busy copying the second leg for your table may you eventually put a table <laughs> on top of it i am starting to feel a little homesick perhaps it is time to end my jenny Salvador. Okay. You get two table legs. Poggers. Anyway, back back to Flappy Bird. Nope, I didn't. I don't want Nap serpent. serpent. Flappy Bird. <laughs> piteous, uh, piteous moonlight. Or pious? Is it pious? Is there a T there? I can't tell. It's. I think it's piteous. 
It's piteous. piteous. Okay. The font is just unfortunate. Or at least... Joe's. <laughs> Dr. Money's portable entertainment product. Trademark. Everything totally trademark. not a Game Boy. This feels like a Game Boy. What do you want, letter man? It's a Game Boy Color because there's colors. <laughs> <laughs> there have been incidents of people getting upset about how hard the games for Dr. Money's portable entertainment product are. I do agree. <laughs> Back to Flappy Bird. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, the fact that they're hard means that it takes time to beat them, so... Close. Damn it. Because I barely even tapped that thing. <laughs> uh, oh, this game. This is whack. It's, Give me another this fucking a, letter. This is a solid. This is like this. This presentable liberty is a solid game. I forgot how how like good it is. I just because I'm I am starting to get lonely because now the letters aren't coming in frequently anymore. Where are you, Salvador? Salvador, my good friend. Salvador Charlotte Dali, Dali, whoever that was. Charlotte, the person who randomly sent me letters because they live in a pastry shop somewhere. Um. My happy buddy, who I hope doesn't lose their daughters. Hopefully, happy buddy goes to goes to jail just like me. Please do remember. Oh God, it's not about those games; it's about happiness. Back to Flappy Bird. <laughs> God, I just realized the meta of this, right? Yeah. I think the games are supposed to piss you off. Oh. Well, they aren't really working too well. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure they would if I wasn't here and you're just like, fuck these games. Um, yeah, but I'd stop, just stop playing them. I'd just sit here and, yeah, and wait and do nothing. Yeah, because I'm not stubborn. I think they're supposed to piss you off so that um, in the game, so that's why the happy buddy's like, please, please be happy. Don't, don't get sad. I found this poster in my attic. I thought it might cheer you up. Then again, it. it it's not very cheerful. Maybe you want it anyway, though. What the fuck? Anyway, back to Flappy Bird. Honest, honest. Yo, cho, 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 cho. Dude, this was six years ago. There's no way Unis Honest was even thought of. Dude, he, Mark didn't even know Ethan at that point. I know. Mark got in, unintentionally inspired by this game six years ago. <laughs> Fun fact. M Memento Mori, by the way. I don't know what you're talking about. Rest in peace, Unisonis. What's Unisonis? Didn't exist. I was just the thing is it exists. You just, you just the thing with Unisonis, right? Is you have to, you have to, you, you, you can confirm it, it exists, but never explain the inside jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Dear Blank, Dr. Money is taking time off, has, uh, take, taking his time off of his busy schedule to tell you personally that everything is fine. Is it? Flappy Bird? Um, yeah, like, you know, you can... Try to... Trying to think of, a, like, a relevant Unisonis reference, but I'm just realizing that anything I say will be shoehorned in. Exactly. Unisonis was a riot. It was, indeed. I actually got to watch every video, and I'm very proud of myself. I'm proud. I'm, uh... Because, like, I, I watched that channel... I watched the first episode of that channel literally when there was only one episode. Did we get the doctor's message? I am increasingly concerned by the way he is ignoring the people's obvious suffering. The antidote was, he was talking about is only being sold at a ludicrous price. He does not mean well. I agree. What a dick. <laughs> anyway, Flappy Bird parallels to real life um yeah but yeah like um Unisonis i was pretty good i, I subscribed to Unisonis because of mark's like introduction video to it he was like hey i'm doing this thing called Unisonis," and i'm like cool i checked it out and it was only the introduction video the 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 cooking with sex toy video wasn't even out yet oh yeah and i watched every single video as they came out i mean sometimes it was a little late but i ended up catching up um and i'm very proud of myself for watching all of them because that was 
Dude, they were just like such a good partnership. I love them yeah. so, both so much. Ethan is fantastic. I am... Dude, Ethan can sing really well, and I love it. I know. His Death of a Bachelor thing that he did on stream a couple times is great. The yeah. Death of a Bachelor. I've seen a lot of his... Uh, I, 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 he, uh, he sung Heather by um, Conan Gray. Of course Gray. he's fucking saying Heather. Which is Everyone's amazing. saying fucking Heather. I loved hearing... Uh, Conan, that isn't Heather. even Conan Gray's best song. It's not a Conan Gray's best song. It's a f fucking amazing song, but it's not... What is Conan Gray's best song, Jay? In your opinion? Mm, I like the cut that always bleeds a lot. I like the story a lot. Um, oh, wait, yeah, the story's up there, too. Let I, me I tell like... you a story about, about a, boy a boy and a girl. And a girl. Kind of short, kind of boring. boring. But the but end is a world. They were just 16 when the people were mean and they didn't love themselves. And now they're gone. Headstones on a lawn. lawn. Okay. <laughs> Oh, and then, and then, and then, Actually, I think I think it's the, I think it goes to the story of the boy and the boy before it goes to the chorus. Oh, whatever. <laughs> anyway, it ain't funny. It Friend, the third leg of the table is finished. Huzzah! I have also started my long journey back to my hometown. I would say I will probably arrive around tomorrow morning. Looking forward to seeing my some familiar faces. Oh, no, everybody's dead. dead. Just maybe, yeah. The, already. The doctor has lowered the price of the antidote. However, it seems to cause various vital organs to fail. Jesus! We are now not only dying from the virus, but also from the doctor's cure. I am terrified. Holy Charlotte. shit. Yeah, I mean, that's what happens when a private corporation controls vaccines. <coughs> Shots fired? <laughs> Guys, I really hate Monsanto. What's Monsanto? They're the people who own the Pfizer vaccine for COVID. Wait, why do they own it? Because Monsanto, Monsanto is also like the people who have like patents on genetically modified food. Uh, that's them. Um, that being said, I certainly think that getting a COVID vaccine is very important. I personally will get one for sure. I'm just hoping that um, I can get one that isn't the Pfizer one because I just really don't like Pfizer. Um, but worst case scenario, I'll have to get it. But so I, I'm not at all condoning not getting a vaccine. It's just... I <laughs> I don't want to get Pfizer if it's possible. Because <laughs> Monsanto, I, I do not like. It's a company. All right, anyways. Letter. Charlotte. Most of my cakes have gone bad. I just hope all this is over soon. I'm not sure how long I can live all alone. I, I wish I could come visit you. I'm not sure you'd like this prison cell, Charlotte. I don't like this place very much, honestly. I just got my Unis Honest poster. My, my, my cracked out Kool-Aid man, my, my weird ass fucking, fucking, uh, acid trip from Sal. We got a poster from Sal, a poster from Charlotte, and a poster from, um, But from we our, do our have Charles, you Swain. don't, you don't, you don't get a Charles to vibe with. Yeah, Charles is from Sal. He just hid behind that table leg. He just walked right through the table leg. I hate when that happens. <laughs> right? Fucking collision boxes. I've just given up on the games because I'm just like, fuck. Yeah. Actually, you want to try serpent again? Yeah, let's try serpent again. We at uh... well, you're on level five in both games. Also, that is definitely a twenty. I don't know what I was thinking earlier. That's what I was thinking. I thought it was a twenty, <laughs> but I wasn't sure. So, so I was just like, I'll run with it. Sorry, Charlotte, I have things to do. <laughs> yeah, I'm back. What do you need, Charlotte? I hope you were getting these letters. I'm guessing you just can't respond. Do letters still get delivered in times like these? I, I hope so. Are you even still alive? Not on the inside. Friend, this one gave me some problems, but your fourth table leg is all you've done now. Last part will be there shortly. <laughs> Salvador, the master woodmaker. Love it. Just waiting for the top. <laughs> back to Flappy Bird. No, I'm on level 7 in this game. Oh, okay. Cool. This game's marginally easier than Serpent. For, for now. 
Fuck. I hate all this weird ass fucking ambient music. <laughs> because it's just like, it's supposed to freak you out, right? Which yeah. it kind of achieves, so at the same time, I'm like, this is whack. Yeah, I need to get to you more if you were if you were alone. Oh yeah, for sure. But it's still kind of getting to me, and I'm not alone. This is the issue. That, that's fair. Are you okay? Apparently, more and more inmates are killing themselves. Jesus! Please do that for your sake and mine. Where's my knife, Charles? I need you to kill me. <laughs> you could pick up one of the wooden uh, table legs and beat yourself over the head. <laughs> Let's go test this theory. <laughs> Can I walk through that? Yeah, but you I can. also like crumble up your posters and like choke on them. Suffocate yourself. Uh, these are all valid options. This is true. This is so you could true. You also eat your uh, entertainment device and probably die from batteries. That's true. <laughs> oh, I, do, I have to be closer to be able to pick that up. You also probably like those wires in the wall. <laughs> <laughs> my dear friend, my good night present to you will be the tabletop. Now you finally have something to put it all on in your cell. Hope you actually have stuff to put on it. Not really, but you know, it's a nice nope. table. No, we just vibe. I hope we get out soon. I don't know if during a, a pandemic, being in a prison would be the best or the worst place to be. Uh, if you're in solitary confinement, it'd be the best place to be. Prison, That's... no. Because prison usually has interaction between inmates. That's a good point. Day four. Day four. table friend my journey has come to an end as you know i do not have a family to come home to but that's not what matters to me i'm just looking forward to the smell of my hometown pog kool-aid man good morning unis honest what up yeah, we are... what up but but God, we are progressing much slower than mark <laughs> It's not. It's not even our fault. The game just goes this slow. I think he probably just. No, it's because it's because you left letters sitting down. Oh, he probably also edited it, but it's because you also left letters for a decent amount of time, probably. But I don't know. I only left them sitting there for like a, a couple you know, you're of probably seconds. Like, right. Let me check Jack's playthrough because this is slightly longer. Maybe he didn't edit it as much. Because I'm gonna bet that he probably edited his. Is that why his is so short? Because you, that's fair. You can't control the amount of time it takes between letters. Yeah, he probably edited it. We like he should edit it too. <laughs> he's probably gonna edit. He probably edited it between letters coming through. Yeah, which we should we should do too, honestly. Table, table, letter, Sal. Where is everyone? Uh, Sal, I don't know if you heard, but everyone's dead because of the virus. Fucking Co COVID, man. COVID got them, man. I don't. They got I, the Rona. They got the Rona. I'm sorry. I hope you find your dad. <laughs> What is this, anyway? Yeah, Sal was out exploring, so he wasn't around when we got the virus. What is this stuff? It's certainly a wire. Not sure why. If I tug on it hard enough, will it electrocute me and kill me? If you touch the copper zips or shit at the end, it should probably electrocute you. Let's go... God damn it, Jay. Nope, I'm fine. <laughs> Morning! I sold my house and my food in one of my lungs, but don't worry. We have a new video game for you. <laughs> I spent the money on another game for you. Yay, have fun, be happy. This guy literally doesn't care about himself, just wants his daughters to be safe. That's so sad. Triangle Wars. What pa What parody is this? Oh my god. It's the impossible game. It's either impossible game or it's... I, I, I was thinking it's, more it's Geometry Dash. It's neither. Because it's just over obstacles. There's no, um... It's more like the dinosaur game from Chrome. That's true. Because you can't jump on top. Holy oh. shit! Oh my god, it's broken. <laughs> I'm just gonna vibe up here. I win. Is that intentional? I don't think so. Oh, you didn't hit the check. <laughs> you can't finish the level because you didn't touch the check. <laughs> That's so good. So, no. I mean, like, obviously, in universe, this wasn't intentional, but did the game devs intend this? <laughs> okay, you want to touch that. Ah, damn it. Not that. That's not the thing I was talking about. 
I figure out what the easiest game is. Yep. <laughs> what do you want, Charlotte? These streets used to be so lively. Now they are just silent. Just like my soul, you emo fuck. Anyways, back to Triangle Wars. I hate you fucking jump outside of the game. Yeah, that's that. Uh, that's not, no way. That's intentional. Right? Oh no, maybe this. Maybe that's their answer to it being too com the, the, uh, to, to the games being too com like complicated. Why did you fail last time? Did you not fall in time? That's what I'm trying to figure out. What do you want? I have this old gramophone in my basement. Perhaps th is it time to break the silence? What's a gramophone again? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's some kind of music player. Let me double check. There's no way you're supposed to double jump in this game, right? No, there's no way. Yeah, it's it's like the old kind of record player. It has Hell like yeah. the the needle and a horn, you know, that it kind of goes to the horn. God, I'm so good at video games, dude. on top of all this stuff until we get to the checkpoint. Do you know what's going on out here? The virus, the organs, the blood? blood. Yeah. Shit. God. That's a violent virus. They, people probably, you know, like, started throwing up blood and stuff. Well, COVID didn't get that bad. No, this virus is clearly much more deadly than COVID. It's like the not, plague. Not, not to say COVID isn't a, isn't a big issue, but... This is definitely worse. This is like the plague, almost. The Black Death. The Black Death. I don't know anything about the Black Death. I just know it killed a lot of people. It killed a lot of people, and the symptoms were really fucked. And there were, like, different stages and shit, you know? Oh, it's a bubonic plague pan pan pandemic. I see. Mistakes were made. I, Dr. Money, want to apologize. I personally apologize for any inconvenience that might have arisen from the virus rock of our creation. Oh. Oh. Please accept this frame picture of Money as a, cons as a consolation. You son of a bitch! <laughs> money survives all hardship. I mean, it's true whenever it comes down to it. Oh my god. They fucking created the virus. I didn't, I didn't remember that. Oh, damn it. People are dying, their organs are failing because of an antidote for the virus, and everyone is infected. I wonder if I am too. Aw, Sal. Sal, don't die, please. It might be now that you met people. Maybe you should have stayed away. Maybe you should have stayed out by that lake that you were talking about so fondly. Yeah. Or maybe not. Who knows? It's, you know, like, I know for me, I couldn't be alone the rest of my life. I'd rather die. Fair enough. Like, staying by a lake sounds fun and all, but, like, if I literally can't see another person for the rest of my life, I would, I would, I would die. <laughs> no problem. Just gotta finish this level real quick. Because I feel like, at least my outlook in life, my experiences don't matter to me. They matter, the part that matters is me getting to share them. Mm hmm Anyhow, there seems to be a huge market for working organs now. <laughs> Dr. Money has a big supply, and everyone is rushing the stores and spending all the money. Those organs are not what they seem. This fucking scam, it's like, here's a problem. Oh, here's, you can solve this problem, but now you get a new problem, which can only be solved by us. If you got a problem, you'll so, all solve it. Check spend out all your money and you'll be okay, involved. or die. Yeah, and death does not sound very poggers. In this world, at least, death is irreversible. Death, did you say death is irreversible? Yeah, in this world, in this world at least. That's true. I just <laughs> finished a book recently called Scythe, right? And the entire okay. premise is like the idea of like death not being your like not being like like imagine if we got to a point in the future where like death wasn't something that you had to face. Mm-hmm. 
like where like we you're constantly up on drugs so even if you do get hurt you don't feel it ever yeah so we're like we're immortal not necessarily invulnerable but immortal yeah we're immortal can't die of old age and the only thing that can kill you is like these people called the scythes who come through and fucking like it's called gleaning where like you get fully killed because you can die but then they bring you back to life really easily Ah, it's very interesting God, the Black Death killed between 75 million and 200 million people. I mean, COVID's... Ki- we thought ki- COVID's killed a lot. Um, but then How again... How many guys COVID did? Killed it's that's, that's it's a only 100,000 so far, I think. Worldwide? So, that's what I thought. Uh, worldwide... Not Michigan, I want worldwide. This is not helpful. Worldwide. Where is this organ music coming from? Not per day, total. Anyone who uses the doctor's organs dies a couple hours later. Where do they come from? What are they? Does it even matter anymore? Are you infected too, friend? Only 2.97 million deaths worldwide. (laughs) Not even close to the pneumonic plague. Oh, yeah. (laughs) How much of the outside world could you hear me in your cell? How high are you even up? I I guess I can't know. Just listen closely. Yeah, we're listening. Oh, she's playing that. Yeah, because you do have a window. That's true. Wait, it sounded so pretty. Why can't we just see another human being? Because that would make you feel less lonely. Isn't that the, aren't they supposed to make me feel less lonely? Anyway, back to Triangle Wars. Back to this totally legitimate game. Does holding spacebar just make you continue jump? Is that what's happening? I'm holding W, yeah, but it's the I'm same premise. W. How high can you go? That's as high as it goes. Oh, okay. <laughs> so they didn't put some thought, because there is a limit. <laughs> Imagine if it just totally went off screen. I feel like if it wasn't intentional, there, there wouldn't be a limit, right? Yeah, that's true. But they could have just accidentally programmed it so that the triangle goes too far. Mm-hmm. Like, it's supposed to have a limit, but it was supposed to be lower than what it is. Yeah, maybe. Could you hear it from up there? It turned up, I turned it up extra loud for you. There's no better times than these for little music. And yet, and yet, I feel lonely. Same. Of course, I could play the music again, but is it worth it? It will never be the same magical moment again. That's true. That one moment, in between all of, my, of the dreary ones. <laughs> this can't go on forever. I think it can. God, I need to rewatch uh, Marks and Dex playthroughs of this. I'm actually really curious now. Like what? What it's like from like a solo perspective? Because I haven't seen this in six years. I've never seen it. Period. <laughs> Good job. I love how you can miss the checkpoint. <laughs> yep, and then you're just going. <laughs> I broke you it. Fall, you fall. You fell to the floor. I think. <laughs> you were going too fast. I'm so proud. I don't even know how many people are dead. I'm afraid to look. I can only see what's outside my window, and I see nothing but blood. I think I am alone. Oof. Everyone is dead. True. Then who's sending us the letters? So the only people we know we know are alive currently is Charlotte's alive right now. Um, I we're pretty sure Sal's still alive, and we're pretty sure um, well Doctor Money's alive, and we're pretty sure that um, Mister Smile My, Smiley's alive. Mm-hmm. The city li- the city's lights are going out. The town has no electricity anymore. The only lights I see are coming from the prison. Oof. Pacing back and forth, waiting for another letter. Bang! Bang! Yeah. Bang! I'm just banging my head against the fucking, like... You could probably also break the glass in that little window and then kill yourself with that. I'm left clicking as fast as I can, Ian. <laughs> it's not working, damn it. God. 
Money survives all hardship. God, he's such an ass. I know. One more day. One more day till what? Till Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. One more day till Halloween. Silver Shamrock. Back to the best game uh, on the planet. One more day until what? Halloween. Mm. You're smart, you can figure that out. <laughs> what, do you know what is... Well, I mean, I don't, but I'm pretty sure I know. One more day. I'd like to assume it means she's gonna come to the prison. Tomorrow evening. Tomorrow evening what? Back to the... Well. Until then, you must come here. I will wait here. But... I can't get out. Lady. There's no way out. Bang. Bang. What a game. Oh, yeah. This is whack as fuck. Bang, bang, bang. Here we go. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't make it, well, I fear this world has no place for me anymore. So if we don't make it to her, she's going to kill herself. I mean, to be fair, I would too. To be fair, no one cares about your opinions. Just from the perspective of if I literally everyone else is dead and I'm like an extrovert and I'm like, this sucks. I will never see another person. I'm going to die. Is this a worldwide thing or just in their country? That's a good question. I don't know. I'm awaiting your arrival. Until then, here's the cake I made for you. It's on. It doesn't go on. Yay! The cake is a lie, Jay. You just ate it all. I did. Jeez. I hope you like it. <laughs> Good job, Jay. What? I haven't eaten him within, what, like five days? Of course I'm Fair gonna... enough. <laughs> Got all the comments on, on the Pacific Library readers are like, um, this really hits different in 2021. True. <laughs> recent ones apparently it's gonna be a third thing because you can carry three things do you hear that wonderful music i tried to head in its direction but it was too over too quickly i'm so tired so sal could hear it too i'll just go sleep in some empty apartment uh -huh. around here god knows that enough of those now i need to see you again friend he's going to sleep I wonder if he'll wake up. I'm I'm not way less sad. I'm just way more mo lonely. Can you duck in this game? No. Because there's some of the bars are like... You're probably still in that cell all alone. Tomorrow I will come visit you. But first, let us rest, friend. Isn't it too early? Buddy, are you playing your games? Are you happy? No. Don't admit that, or they're gonna die. Or their daughter's gonna die. I'm not happy. Somebody fucking kill this dick. <laughs> Take his I daughter. Buddy. Take it. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Either give me what I want, want, or or the bunny gets it. I am happy but tired. Sleep, buddy. Sleep. No thanks. I want more cake, damn it. Damn it, Charlotte. <laughs> Tomorrow it'll all end. end. Tomorrow it'll, it'll all end. That's all right. Is that the last day then? Next tomorrow's the last day? Maybe. I don't remember. Maybe. I don't know how this game works. Anyway, back to the best game on the planet. Best game on the planet. We love it. Yes, sir. Day five. I'm assuming this is the last day. It would make sense. Five days a stranger. Let's go. Lord. Quick that. No, you have to walk closer to it. <clears throat> good morning. Good, good, good morning. Are you all good? All fine? I don't care. I was never your friend. I, I'm not your friend. I was never your friend. Dr. Money was blackmailing me. He kidnapped my daughters. Hey, Pog. Kidnapping? Let's go. 
He told me they were safe. He told me they were they would be okay as long as I kept you happy, but he lied. Did he kill your daughters? My daughters are dead. Shit. They died from the virus two days ago. I never even got to say goodbye. Shit. But I but to you I will. Wait, am I gonna die or is he gonna die? Well, I never had to say goodbye to them, but to you, I will say goodbye. Well, you cannot lose hope, as I now have. I have another game for you. Not yet. Yeah. I don't have the money for such expenses, but there's a huge market for organs now. Oh god, is he gonna give away all of his organs for one last game? I have already sold one of my lungs yesterday, and now I will finish what I have started. Shit! <laughs> Dude, this is fucked. Yeah, no, it is. Uh... I, I don't want to sell my lungs. I like my lungs. I signed for them to take all of my organs, money up front. I will not survive the procedure, of course, but that's not important. Jesus Christ. This is only slightly dark, huh? You are the only you are one of the only ones left who are still healthy. Healthy. Please don't lose hope. A little late for that. I hope you enjoy the game. Not it's not here game. yet. <laughs> I doubt it because it isn't fun. Like seriously, not at all. I hope you keep going anyway. Always keep going. Don't give up, like me. You never know how much more time you have. Crankmaster. Crankmaster. <laughs> I, I'm not sure how this game works. I'm confused. I'm so confused. Oh, you just have to like, con like, go around with your fucking like keyboard, like around, like, you know, like, yeah. in that circular motion, like W A S D, like that. And that's it. <laughs> yep. Okay. Just well, kind of sad. Goodbye. F's in chat for my boy. <laughs> it's not fun. Like seriously, not at all. <laughs> I'll Truly. inform you. This is the best game you've given me so far. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> God, I'm having fun. <laughs> I don't care enough. It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has stopped talking to you. We would like to remind you that you are loved and that you must remain happy. Back to my favorite game. Master. I like how it saved your level progress, which doesn't usually happen. Oh, yeah. Well, this is why this is the best game. <laughs> God. God, I'm reading some of the, just some of the comments. Jack says... Imagine if this happened in real life. People would be looting, breaking into houses, and killing people. <laughs> 2020. <laughs> write that down, write that down. <laughs> God. It's kind of crazy, though, that this actually happened. What up? You're worth every penny of the money I spent to keep you here, just in case that I have to die someday. I won't die because you, you can help me not die because you're safe. That's why That's I care about is myself. So I am Dr. Money. Dr. Money. Can I tell you how great your Crank Master game is with Dr. Money? <laughs> Shit's pog as fuck. We might have to play Example Money at some point. 
Possibly. And you know what I want to play the next on the channel? Crank Master. <laughs> 420, Crank let's go. Done. Now that it's 420, I can't do anymore. See, funny number. Wait, no, we have to go till my birthday. No, I'm just kidding. Hello there, Mr. Unis Honest Heart Man. Why won't these wires yeah, just shock we me? We definitely have to play Xapple Money. We will play Xapple Money. We will play it. Okay. <laughs> I just looked at it real quick and I'm like, yep. For sure. The town is dead. There's no life left in it. I'm walking through these streets all alone. I'm on my way. Hey, Sal's not dead yet. Hey, Pog. I'm gonna tear down these fucking posters. So so far, one of our one of our four uh, mess message message people have died. One of them have died. And that was good, Mr. Uh, Smiley, right? Mr. Smiley. F's in chat. Money survives all hardship. <laughs> Can't even play that game anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that game. Back to Crank Master. <laughs> the only one that you finished. Listen, I can finish Crank Master probably. But I don't know, man. It seems a little. Wait, can... and I can't even use my. I I'd, I'd like. Wish I could use my mouse to fucking do it. That'd be nice. I'm you having use your fun. Mouse on Dr. Money's portable entertainment product. I'm having fun. <laughs> this is entertaining. What do you want? You're ruining my experience. Sal. Think I'm close to your prison. I'm really looking forward to seeing you again. You being in that cell all this time, you'll still be alive, right? Sal! Sal's gonna come and infect us from both Sal! Today. Sal, let me out! This game just makes you just really, really want to see another person. I agree. Back to Dr. Not back to Dr. Money's crank master. God, this is so much fun. Uh, near the near the beginning of quarantine, I like seriously this game is a perfect analog for how I kinda felt. You know? Yeah. Like, because especially the beginning of quarantine, it's like you were not allowed to leave your house. You know, at least out here. There were orders against leaving your house. Like oh, and later like, levels, the the fucking cranks get oh, faster. Nice. Like, like, um, like they were, you know, like, like to the point where if you were driving and a cop saw you, they'd pull you over and ask where you're going. Yep. Like it was, it was straight up like orders to stay home. Um, and as an extrovert, I felt so fucking drained because I could not see another person. I was sleeping until 6 p.m. some days. It was horrible. So I really feel that kind of like trapped in a prison thing and only like having discord and stuff, which wasn't even good enough to talk to people. And, so, like, I know this game was made six years ago, but, God, I feel it. <sighs> More letters. Oh, uh, yeah. Might be writing to a dead man. That thought is kind of scary. I'll not give up, though. A little virus won't kill you now, will it? Yes. Well, it will if you spread it. Anyway, us. back to crap. Crank Master. Crank Master. Okay, I'm having close. fun. Right. Fun. Fun. Crank Master is the pinnacle of entertainment. What would I do without Crank Master? Listen, we have noticed that you are being contacted by someone with a measurably free spirit. We would like you to ignore all of his letters from now on. That's Sal. No, they're gonna take Sal. Crank master, help Salvador. <laughs> this comment on, on one of the videos. 
<laughs> I mean, everyone's talking about each person's relationship to you, but like, bug friend could have left at the mail slot at any point and didn't choose to leave, so I think that's pretty nice. They were obviously <laughs> programmed that way. <laughs> Damn it, Charles. His canonic name is now Charles for everyone's playthrough. I don't care if you... They were just wrong if you named him something else. Am I right or am I right? I wish I'd saved some of that cake. Whoa. Anyway, back to Crank Master. Hold on. What? I mean, go ahead and continue, but... Iron? Oh my god, okay. What? Hey. Hmm. So, real talk. I just found something out. The creator of this game committed suicide a couple years ago. Shit. Yeah. Um. Apparently, I just, I, I saw a random comment that mentioned something and I just looked into it real quick and it says that the creator committed suicide in 2018 at some point and this is his kind of um like embodiment of his depression and how he felt this game shit which makes it all that much crazier um but yeah this con because i saw it in this comment here that says this game is is depression feels it's how it feels to be isolated if you want to reach out and beg for help to tell everyone that you're here and want to see them but you can't and the world simply says try harder and be happy this was the dev speaking from the heart. May he rest in peace. Mm -hmm. And that's crazy. Um, yeah. I was not aware of that. Me either. Um, God, okay. That just well, kind of takes us all on a whole new, like... Yeah. Um, when was this last post here? Because he tried to do a Kickstarter to remake the games, and it failed in 2014. Um, interesting. All right, well, um, there's some links in the description for you if you are suffering from depression or any, or you want to talk to anybody or anything. It's, it's, uh, it, you're loved. There are people who will love you in your life, even if you can't, even if you don't know that, even if you can't quite grasp that or why they'd love you. It's, it, it's true. There are always people out there who care about you and people who, will miss you if you if you if you leave and and I know it can feel helpless in the moment I've been there I am there a little bit now at this point and it's just it's just you, you can you can get through it I believe in you if you have any, anyone to talk to I'm sure there are people in our discord server like I, this is not even a promo thing it's just like a place like you can go there talk to me you know you can go there look find my account and talk to me I if you're open with that like I'm totally down with um with that just because I I care about you guys and I know plenty of people do and if anybody is at all anywhere near this depressed, then it's hard to get help, but it's it's what you need. And and it's 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 and you can't just like it's really hard to explain because it's not yes, the world just kinda says, Yes, try just try to be happy, you know, and that's it isn't that simple and that's the problem, right? It's it is a constant struggle every day, and every day that you survive, you win. You win a battle, right? You win a battle every single day you survive, but all it takes is one loss, you know, and it's really, really scary. And I am here for any of you who need it, and I want to be here for anybody who needs it. So just just take care of yourself, and if you need anything, let us know. Yeah. That's... I think what I have to say on that. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I am sorry. I literally did not know that. Yeah, that's a bit of an issue. Um. God.
Anyhow. Yeah. <clears throat> you're being taken care of. You're being protected from the virus and the horrors of the outside world. Do not forget you are a prisoner. Shit. Thank God I can see the prison from here. Please don't kill Salvador. Maybe one or two hours now. I can't wait. And once I'm there, I will release you from your prison. That this friend of yours, Salvador, he cannot be here. I do not appreciate the way he talks. I do not appreciate the way he's been talking about freedom to you. This is no joke. Seesaw contact with this Salvador. Friend, I have arrived. Where's your cell? Where are these letters being sent to? And I cannot seem to even enter the building. All the doors are locked. Broke in, but the elevator won't come, and there's no stairs. It seems that I have no way of getting somewhere, well, however high you are up. There must be a way. It's getting late, friend. Maybe I don't have to get up there. Maybe, maybe you could just come down to here. You know, the building you're in was never supposed to be a prison. There are no cells on the bottom floor. And look at the plants. There's no cells here anyway. Dr. Money must have repurposed the building for locking you up, but why would he do that? It seems so arbitrary. Hmm. But no matter. What ha matters is that the lock on your cell door is powered by electricity, which means that if I manage to destroy the prison generator, you will be free to leave, friend. Oh. Are you coming? Shit. Please tell me that you'll come. I'm so lonely. I'm sorry, friend. I'm sorry. Fuck! I found the generator, friend. I only destroy it. I only need to destroy this, and you will be free. Come find me at the entrance, friend. I'm looking forward to shaking your hand once more. God. Shit. Let's go. Wait. Oh. Your friend tried to destroy the generator. That didn't really work out too well for him, did it? He got electrocuted. Your friend is dead. Shit. They all are. Now your cell door may be open. But what do you think leaving will accomplish? This town is dead. You and I are the last ones here. The backup generator only has energy for those red lights. So the door is unlocked now. Shit. Just stay in your cell. I will send someone to fix the generator for you. Wait, how could he s send someone if we're the only ones left? You will be able to keep playing games on your portable entertainment product. This is true. <laughs> I could just, like, stay here and keep playing flat Without people. care in the world. I will even tell you why you're here. You will never know that if you leave. You will never be allowed to do whatever you wish. You will be allowed to do whatever you wish. On one condition. You don't leave that room. Do not open that door. I'm out. Uh, just no, no hesitation. No hesitation. Fuck that shit. I Fuck actually that don't bitch. know what happens if you don't. I bet you would probably just make you do it somehow. See, elevator button. Elevator button. Oh shit. I forgot about this. Where's the elevator? What's at the end of the elevator button? Oh shit, we were living in yeah. the elevator? I forgot about that. Holy shit. It's a good game. That's crazy. Backup generator in my ass. You can power a fucking elevator. <laughs> um, get it? Uh, what? What the going fuck? Going kind of fast. What? What? Uh, yeah. No, 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 Dude, impact's gonna be fucking insane.
Holy shit. Charles. Charles, goodbye, Charles buddy. This is a fucking long ball. Jesus. Holy How shit. Big is this building? Why is that all so quiet now? How big is this building? That's what I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> just, just play games while you're falling in the other <laughs> <laughs> Oh. You're safe. Somehow. The fuck was that? The fuck is going on, dude? We get to leave. What's that? Is that the bakery? Charlotte's Delicious Pastries. Closed. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Yep. To my only friend. Oh, wait, that's you. When you are reading this, I will already be dead. My shop will probably look quite ne messy. I have decided that I'll go to the back room to die so you don't have to look at my corpse. I'm sorry I couldn't be more patient in waiting for you. Holy fucking shit. But that doesn't matter now. <laughs> what matters is that you're here. Against all odds, you managed to escape the prison. I'm aware that this may seem like a, a bad ending to the story. But you're here! here and I have baked another cake for you. I'm not sure how fresh it will be when you find this. As for all I know, you never will. But I hope you enjoy it anyway. I wish you the best of luck. Charlotte. That's a lot. Yeah. That's a fucking lot. I don't like that shit. I don't like any of this shit. The next morning. Oh fuck, what's gonna happen? Please tell me we find Sal and everything feels better. Sal got electrocuted. Yeah, but he could have been- Well, according to Dr. Money, that's true. There's the- Empty rooms of the quote unquote prison. Holy fuck. Whose perspective is this? Wait, what's going on? <gasps> Charles still... Then Charles leaves. No, that's the sweetest ending. The end. It's a heavy game. No shit. God, I didn't... <sighs> I didn't realize it was going to hit me so hard. Like, holy shit. God. Alright. So. 
That hit me really fucking hard. That was a lot to take in. Yeah. A lot of emotions in that. You feel it when that shit happens, you know? Yeah. God. I didn't... I'm just like I'm not meaning to just sit here but like no no I get it that shit's a lot and it's and just it's, like it's just worse those, knowing being in those dark people. places and thinking about being in those dark places and where yeah. I, I, I'm having been in those dark places it's just fucked yeah no it really is and it's especially it's, when the creator's done that and stuff you know yeah like that's just like too heavy <laughs> I I'm sorry yeah, I didn't know that that was no, it's, that, that it's all good. It's all good. It's just like, well, like I said, it just it takes a second to like take it in, you know. Shit. All right. I I'll sit. I'd sit here forever and just like, like feel this, but we gotta we gotta let the people go. So uh. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen boys and girls all you beautiful valid people out there if you enjoyed this please leave a like that'd be greatly appreciated comment down below tell us what you thought subscribe with post notifications if you want to know what if you want to see what we're up to next and uh join the discord there's some beautiful people there and follow the treasure because eventually i'll use it again and uh yeah. If you feel any, even like a quarter or an eighth or any way like this, please, like, this talk is... to somebody. I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not saying you have to talk to anybody in your life about it or whatever. Just anybody, do anything that you can to, because you're worth it. I know, like I was saying earlier, it won't feel like that. It may feel like you're a burden on people, but you aren't. Please never do that to yourself because that the, the world loses a, a great human being every time that happens. Yeah. And with that, we'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day, night, whatever time it is for you. And we'll see you later. I hope you got something out of this. And yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Love y'all. Bye. Bye. Wow. That was a game and a half. <laughs>